Hey, 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 welcome. If you are new here, welcome back. If you have been here before, I am Freya. This is Budgie Budgets and it's Wednesday. And on Wednesdays, we cash stuff. Um, so we are here today to do our regular cash stuffing uh, into all of our binders and also our 500 giveaway announcement. Woo! Um, so I'm so excited. I'm so excited to have 500 subscribers. You guys, I just never in my wildest would I have thought so many people would be interested in watching me do this and just chitter chatter about my life, I suppose. Um, so I'm really, really grateful. Um, before I get to it, I have woken up. My son was a little bit, um, off color last week and his uh, best friend had been off school all week because he tested positive for the flu and I have woken up this morning aching from head to toe and with a bit of a scratchy throat so I have got my trusty uh, cup of tea just to try and keep my voice going <laughs> off to the side here um, so I am sorry if I sound a bit funny um, but obviously it's important to get cash stuffing done no matter how we're feeling. Um, and also I want to thank everybody to, um, for their response to the Christmas binders, which sold out so fast, you guys. So, so fast. If I had have known that was going to happen, I probably would have held off listing them until I was ready to make, uh, a few more. I'm just waiting on some supplies. Um, I just need some more binder clips and stuff. Um, and then I will pop them back up. And there'll be a lot more of them, so hopefully they won't sell out again. Um, but thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. And well done to those of you who got in quick enough to get yours. Um, it's so awesome. I just, oh, I can't even, I can't, I can't even express how, um, how grateful I am for you guys and how just absolutely lovely it is that you love the stuff that I create. It's so cool. Uh, so, so cool. So with that in mind and having said that, the first part of my thank you so much for 500 subscribers will be a new addition to my, um, oh my goodness, mental blank, my freebies folder below. So if you haven't already checked that out, Go down and click the link. Um, I think there's three in there at the moment and then I'll be adding, I just added to add five. So there'll be one for every um, every 100 of you <laughs> have joined me on my little thing. So the first one is a spring challenge book, obviously coming into spring in Australia. Um, so I thought a spring challenge might be handy. I just it'd be really good for mini Mondays or tiny Tuesdays or whatever mini challenges you're doing as well, or just as a regular challenge. So there's 25 little flowers. You get to choose how much they're worth and you can mark them off as you go. I went with 25 instead of 24 because <laughs> for us Aussies who don't want to use single dollars in challenges like that, the 25 means if you make them two each, well, if you make them one each, it's rounded off to five. If you make them two each, it rounds off to 50. And that just felt like nice. Um, I am aware that <laughs> there are quite a few of you who watch me who are not from Australia. Um, so I also have Hello Fall. Um, I might, I might do Hello Autumn as well. Cause I th think I could be wrong. Tell me if I'm wrong, but I think in the UK, you guys call it autumn too, like we do here, but in the US you call it fall, I think. So anyway, there's Hello Fall and I'll probably do Hello Autumn as well. Cause it won't take me long just to change that. So there's 25, um, four leaves and you get to choose again how much each of those are then we have a boo-boo fund uh, so I thought this one might be fun there's 15 little band-aids um, I thought that might be cool for like saving towards emergency fund or saving towards medical fund whatever then we have trick or treats because obviously it is going to be Halloween soon Woo -woo. Um, and I definitely need to do a mini Mondays challenge for Halloween because I have not saved much for Halloween yet um so i thought that might be cool and then the last one is budget goodies because i just kind of thought that if you're anything like me maybe it might be nice to have a challenge to put some money aside to spend on savings challenges and fun things on etsy <laughs> um so this is just budget goodies so you can either make it a roll and save or you can determine the amounts that you want to put in there however you want to do it um but yeah that's the last one. So secondary to that, um, I will be doing a giveaway. Um, 
it will be open, <laughs> I'm hesitating because I get nervous when I have to send things overseas, but it will be open internationally. Um, I The giveaway will be for a set of eight trackers. So you can choose any, um, any trackers from my Etsy, um, like either the black and white ones or the colorful ones, I don't mind. Um, and also uh, 10 budgie bucks. So that'll be the little, that'll be the little, so 10 of these little guys. Um, ooh, there, some of those are upside down. Um, let's just fix that, shall we? <laughs> um, so yeah, so any of the colorful trackers um, and they will be posted to you. So I think I will leave it open for, I think I'll leave it open for a week, maybe a week and a half. So let's announce the winner, not this Friday, but next Friday's savings challenge video. And I should have checked the date, but I will put it in the description down below. All you need to do to enter is be subscribed to my channel um, and comment on this video. Um, and also, uh, this won't be part of the this won't be part of the thing. So you just need to be subscribed to my YouTube channel and leave a comment down below with a blue heart. That's it. And then um, you will be entered into the draw. Uh, so if you can do that for me, and then um, also head on over to my Instagram and give me a follow there as well, mainly because I do do shop updates on my Instagram and it's probably the easiest way to keep up with what's happening on my Etsy. I'm terrible with Instagram. I don't post nearly as often as I should, um, but when I'm uploading stuff to the store, I do usually put it there uh, so that you know what's going on. Oh, oh my birdie's throwing a little tanty. Yay. Anyway, <laughs> all right. So now that we have that cool, fun stuff out of the way, let's get, I probably should have done that at the end of the video, shouldn't I? Is that like one of those cheeky things that people do that like keep you watching until the end kind of thing? Whatever, I don't mind. Okay, so today we are going to be cash stuffing this bundle of money in front of me. I think it should be $480. So we have 50, uh, you know what? My brain's not all there today, so I'm not going to try and count it out like that. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 120, 140. Whoops. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 110, and 120, which should give us $480. So let's get to it. Whoops. Oh my goodness. She's going off like a pork chop. Just give me a moment. I might go close that other door. She's going to be doing that such a menace oh she stopped again okay let's see how we go <laughs> she's got all her toys and i've given her some um fruit and veggies to play with so she should be fine uh subscriptions is being skipped today water is getting i feel a bit jammed up here today i don't know what i've done differently anyway water's getting 20 uh, so that now has 100 in the bank and 20, 40, 60. I'm a bit scared for our water bill. I feel like all of our bills have been so high. Makes me a little bit nervous. Uh, now, electricity is getting 50 because the electricity company assure me that my electricity bill is going to go down a little bit because I changed plans. <laughs> I'll believe it when I see it. Uh, 200, 420, 40 in there, 240, uh, 440 rather. Um, but we do also have that $300 coming from the federal government uh, for electricity bill relief. So hopefully that will help a little bit. Uh, gas is getting 70 because I'm going to need it to cover the bill that's due by the end of this month because that was an ugly one. Uh, $740. Ugh. So that was 200, 400 in there now, 450, 500, 520, 540. Yeah, so we need like another $200 in there uh, before the end of August. I'm just going to have a sip of tea. I can feel my poor throat going. <laughs> I hate getting sick. 
Uh, okay, phones is getting 35 now because Telstra have put up their recharge mounts. Which drives me insane. I can't honestly believe that anything is costing them. Like, I, you know, I doubt they've put their staff's wages up or anything like that. Uh, so 200, 320, 40, 55, 355 in there. Um, yeah, that's annoying. Um, home is just getting a five. We've got to build this one back up. It feels like there's always something from this category. I really probably need to give it a bit more money than I do, but at the moment, it's just going to have to survive. And security is getting five as well. Which is good. This will either be for new security cameras or for the ones that we already have. We have to pay a yearly subscription for like the cloud service. Uh, so it's 50, 65 in there. Um, but yeah, I was thinking about replacing them with ones that you, that just go back to base at home. So you don't have to pay for that. Uh, garden's getting skipped. And so is everything else in here today? So that is all for this one. Uh, and then we have the car binder. Oh, insurance. You guys, help a sister out, okay? So <laughs> I have looked high and low. Uh, this is getting $30 today. And I cannot find an insurance quote that is better than what my current company have given me. Um, which is no big surprise because, uh, so this has 200, 330 now. <laughs> and I need 1,350. So that's a pretty dire situation, isn't it? Um, yeah, because like I was saying, I've been a customer of theirs for 20 years, so I'm a rating one driver, which means they give me um, special discounts and whatever else. Um, so yeah, the closest quote I can find is still like $150 more expensive than what they've quoted me, which just really sucks. Um so uh registration got 15 so it's got 200 315 in there now so i don't know i think i will be able to cash flow it this month i am I, like don't get me wrong i am still going to call them and have a whinge <laughs> i'm still going to call them and have a complaint i did it over their chat function already and they were really unhelpful so i bet last year i actually spoke to them on the phone and they did give me a little bit of money off the premium it was nothing to write home about but um, even if they bring up the value of what they're covering the car for, I would be happier. Oh, it just got really dark. I hope the sun comes back out because that is very dark now. Um, yeah, I'd be a little bit happier if they increase what they're insuring it for. Um, but given that I can't find anything better, I'm just going to see if I can turn on these lights a little bit. No, nope, that one's out of battery. Let me try this one. Don't know if that's helpful or not. I don't want to create like more shadows. Uh, let me just check. Mm. Oh, it looks like the sun's coming back out, so maybe we won't bother for now. Um, yeah, I'm not sure whether to. I think I will be able to cash flow it. Um, uh, service is getting 10. Um, but just given what's happening around the world just at the moment, and it does look like America will be heading into a recession, and then, you know... It doesn't necessarily mean that Australia will follow suit, um, but obviously it does make things, you know, America's a world leader, right? So they're one of the biggest economies in the world, which means that when they're affected, kind of it, the effects flow on to everybody else as well. Um, so car service now has 115. So in my head, when I'm looking at our budget for the month, I'm like, right, I think because we do have that golden paycheck this month, that I will be able to get this to where I need it to be if I can finish that savings challenge, um, the car alarm challenge, then I will be able to have enough money to pay it. However, I am seriously considering changing it to a monthly payment and dumping all of that money into um, $5 for car tires, which means we can finally color off another one, um, into our emergency fund just because our emergency fund really isn't where I would like it to be. Uh, so $20 in car tires. <clears throat> Sorry guys. Um, yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you would do. So the downsides of changing it to a monthly payment, 
um, are that it costs more. So some companies, $5 going to license. Some companies, um, like my home insurance, they let us change to a monthly payment this year with no added cost um, as a cost of living, like easing the pressure on families thing, which I, I was really impressed with. Uh, so license now has 50, 70, 80. However, my car insurance company does not do that. So across the entire year, if I switch to monthly repayments, it's going to cost an extra $250 um, versus if I pay it up front. Um, however, putting that money straight onto the credit card would save us about roughly $170 in interest across the year. Um, so there's that argument, but also that's not likely what I would do with that. I would likely put it straight into the Crystal Challenge into our emergency fund, just so that we've got a little bit more of a buffer. You know, if things do start getting a bit hectic here in our economy, that just gives us that little bit more comfort. Um, but I'm just, I'm really on the fence about it, you guys. I really, really am. So let me know what you think. Let me know what you would do. Do you currently pay your car insurance annually or do you pay it monthly? Um, yeah, I'd be really, really keen to hear your thoughts uh, on that particular issue. <laughs> okay, so do you even have car insurance? Actually, is another one. Clothing's getting 10. Um, yeah, do you have... Do you have full comprehensive car insurance? Obviously, that's what I'm, um, what the quote for my car is. Uh, so thirty dollars in clothes now, uh, or just like third party fire and theft, or um, yeah, I think because we're not in a financial position to just go out and buy a new car. If something did happen to our car, then that makes me um, really want comprehensive insurance because yeah, if something happened. Um, we would be, we would be in a real pickle if we didn't have a car. Uh, shoes is getting 10. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm pretty reluctant to cancel it, but it is so much money. Uh, hair's getting skipped, skincare is getting skipped, but gifts is getting 10. I think we're finally nearly on top of all of the presents for my daughter's friends. I think we have a few weekends off of kids birthday parties which i am so grateful for i find them really tiring i think that's just a probably a neurodivergent thing uh so 20 40 55 um just making small talk and <laughs> um all the noise and everything else is just really i find them quite overwhelming a lot of the time uh okay everything else in there is skipped for this week um, I do still have to come up with a present for my auntie though, which is proving difficult. Um, she did find the most gorgeous dress though, so I'm really happy about that. Um, at a shop that I took her to last week, so that was super fun. Um, doctors is just getting tan. I probably won't stuff this like for a few, every week of this month just because I need that money elsewhere, obviously. <laughs> Uh, so we've got 200, 420, 430, 440 in doctors. Um, yeah. Uh, what else? Medication's getting skipped, but ambulance is getting, whoops, five. Beautiful. I've got my... Um, Kids, I'm filming this on Tuesday, so it'll go up tomorrow, but um, I've got my kids swimming tonight, so I've got like a <laughs> watch list ready to go, download it on my iPad <laughs> for YouTube while I'm sitting there waiting for them to finish up their lessons. Um, and I really need to sit and reply to all of your beautiful comments on my videos. I'm very behind with that. I have read them all. Um, I just haven't had time to. I read them like as soon as they come up. <laughs> um Oh, oh, did I put that in? I don't think I did. Did I? I don't think so. I hope not. I'll know at the end. 250, 270, uh, 280, 290. Nah, I don't think I, I think that was right. In dental, and they just sent me a reminder saying, Freya, you are really overdue for your dental checkup. Whoops. Uh, specialist is getting skipped, but optical is getting a five. 
Uh, I won't colour that in yet, but I'm supposed to colour that in when it hits a 10. And Skin Check is also getting just a 5 today. That's also a $10 colour in, so I will leave that. Whoops. Oh my goodness, can't pick it up. Uh, so that has 50.75 in there. Okay, beautiful. That is everything for our health slash medical binder. Moving right along to school. Um, now school expenses is getting 10. I really, oh my goodness, I keep doing that. I really don't want to slow down on this envelope. Uh, I might have to this month just to, like I want to kind of be adding 20 a week to it if I can. Uh, so that's got 100, 100, 120, 130, 140 in there now. Um, yeah, just so that I can really keep on top of it. My daughter does have that big excursion coming up. Oh, how good is tea when you have like a scratchy throat? It's like the best thing ever. <laughs> Uh, uniforms is getting 20, is it? Did I just put 20 in there? I did. I wasn't supposed to. Uniforms is getting 10, not 20. <laughs> oh dear. Pay attention, lady. Beautiful. I have been noticing that my daughter's school jumper is starting to look a little bit short on her. Uh, so that has 120, 130, 140 in there now. Um, yeah, so I have a feeling probably going to have to replace that. And my son's school pants are also starting to look a little bit short. Um, <laughs> sport is getting skipped. Swimming is getting skipped. School books is getting 10. I am conscious that this does not have nearly enough in it. Come December when they start telling me I have to buy all the books for next year. Although... We are getting $400 per child from the Victorian government, so I'm hoping that will help. Although, probably really, it's only enough to pay for school fees. Sorry, you guys, the lighting's going in and out. Something shocking is because the sun keeps going behind the cloud. Um, so we've got 50, 70, 80, 95 in the school books now. So, I mean, it's not bad, but really, by the end of the year, I probably need like $800 in there, to be honest. Um, photos is being skipped, tech is being skipped, and school holidays is getting just a five. So I won't colour that in either just yet. Oops, get in there. There we go. And that is all for the school binder. Um, and then our little petsies. Bluebell's going really well. She came out of her cage yesterday, just hung around for a little while. Um, she is very attached to me. She very much prefers life when I'm in the room with her. Um, but yeah, she came out and she was just kind of wandered around on top of her cage for a little while. She's super keen on flying, but because they clipped her wings, she can't fly properly, which makes me so, so nervous. I'm keen for when her wings grow back in and then I'm confident that she can fly around without like hurting herself. Um, so that now has in it $100, $230, which is good. Definitely want to keep amping that up though, because that will be depleted soon. Uh, and then the dog's treatment will get a 10. Um, the dogs have got pretty used to her now. Like they're pretty, um, they're definitely interested. Like they like watching her, but we all sit together in the one room when I'm working, which is super cute. I've got the dog's bed in there. <laughs> and Belle and me um so it's really nice really very nice um yeah it'll be interesting to see like if she starts talking and stuff it'll be so much fun uh okay family fun is getting a 20 oops speak of the devil and she will start chirping <laughs> She makes so many noises and we hear, we have a lot of cockatoos and kookaburras uh, around our house and she tends to respond to them, which is really funny. Like she hears them outside and starts squawking back. Um, okay, so Family Fun now has 20, 40, 60 in there. That's great. Love that. Uh, I think that's all for this envelope. It really, really is. Although I am going to have to start adding money to nails again now. <laughs> oh dear. 
What a silly sausage. Uh, okay, so uh, that one's getting skipped. Father's Day is getting a five. I might have to make a little Father's Day challenge for, um, is that the right pink? I don't know. Uh-oh, is it? Uh, I think it's different. Whoops. Oh, well. It might be different or it might just be because it's not dry. You know how Sharpies change color slightly when they dry? <laughs> Um, okay, so that now has 20, 40, and 50 in there, which is good. Definitely want some more in there. I might, I might have to make a tree. I think I might make a little, a little Father's Day, um, for Mini Mondays, a little Father's Day tracker. Okay, and then we are doing $10 in tickets. Oh, so excited. I really want to do a scratch off, but I'm not going to because I only have $10 to put in here. So I think I'll just do, um, I think I'll just do the first one, like the, the little gnomes. Yeah, I will. I'll do, I'll do these little guys. Uh, what color do I want to cross them off in? Black seems so harsh. Maybe we'll do red or green. I might do green since that's green. Uh, so we're just going to cross off the first 10 in there. Rolling with my nomies. You guys are going to get sick of hearing that because I can't help myself <laughs> every time. Okay. Yay. Christmas binder officially started. That's so exciting. I mean, like I've already, I've already got all of the money saved for Christmas, but you know what I mean. I know you know what I mean. Oh, it's that. It's that much. It's that marker that I normally use for Father's Day, is it? Why isn't it? Yeah, it is. I'm a dag. Oh, well. Never mind. All right. So, $5 in for my son's birthday. So, yeah, whatever bug he brought home. He had, like, a really sore neck just for, like, a day or two. Um, and some body aches and a bit of a runny nose. Uh, 200, 250, 270, 280, 285. Uh, but he only missed, like, a day of school. I think because it was right on the weekend. So... He was all right by kind of the third day. He was all good. But yeah, myself and my hubby have both gone down <clears throat> with it uh, today. Yay. Uh, five going into here for my oldest birthday. So that has 120, 40, 50 in there now. Oh my goodness. Some serious trucks going down the road. And five for my littlest's. So she has 55 now and we are also doing five for my darling. Beautiful. So 10, 15, 20 and five for me. Yay. <laughs> Our birthdays will definitely be a slow burn kind of situation, but that's okay. As long as we're adding something in there, right? So 20 in there for me as well. My lovely old little queenie note on there. <laughs> okay. So that is everything for that. And then hopefully we should have $60 left over, I think. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and 60. Yay! So we've got $60 left over for savings challenges. So I will be back to do those with you on Friday because I have a feeling otherwise this video is going to go way too long. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for joining me today. Do not forget to comment with a blue heart um, in the comments below and make sure you subscribe to my channel so that you can enter the giveaway. Also, those new freebies will be in my folder when this video updates. So go forth and help yourselves. I hope you enjoy them. I hope you love them um, because I love you guys and I'm so, so grateful for your being here. So I will see you on Friday. I hope you're having a brilliant week. I'll catch you soon. Love you guys. Bye.